The Bob Go Rule Engine is a powerful tool that enables users to streamline and automate their order and performance processes based on a set of predefined rules. Rules perform automated actions when certain conditions are met. Essentially, each rule type will trigger an action based on specific conditions which are linked to a variety of attributes like order tags, order weight, order value, and so on. The rule engine is designed in such a way that it's easy for merchants to manage and see what rules have been set up and also to create new rules. Filters have been added to be able to filter on rules if multiple rules have been set up. It's also easy to enable, disable, delete, edit, or copy a rule. Setting up a rule begins by selecting a specific rule trigger. The first one is when an order is created. This rule will be triggered when any order is created on BobGo, either manually through a CSV import or imported from a sales channel. The second rule type is when determining the preferred service level for order rates. This rule will automatically select the cheapest rate for your order or execute an action based on your settings for a specific courier or service level. Then we've also added a rule for after an order has been fulfilled. This rule type will only execute the specified action once an order has been fulfilled. Let's set up a new rule. As an example, I'll choose the when an order is created trigger. You will now be presented with a screen for you to set up multiple conditions and one action. You can set up multiple conditions and then specify whether you want all of the conditions to match or if any of these conditions can be met to execute the action. There are many conditions for you to choose from. You can select that this rule must always be executed or you can go through the list and select a condition that matches your requirement. For example, I want a rule for when my order total value is greater than or equal to 1000 Rand. And I also want to specify that this rule must only apply to manual orders. This means that the action will not apply to any orders coming from CSV imports or sales channels. I also need to specify that all these conditions must match in order for the action to be executed. So for this rule, I want to set a declared value to the orders matching the conditions, and I want to set a declared value of 100 Rand. This rule now states that when my order total value is greater than or equal to 1000 Rand, and it's received from a manual order, then a declared value of 100 Rand will be added automatically to these orders. This rule has now been added to my list of rules but I can easily go and change the priorities. The rule engine has a very convenient drag and drop functionality and rules are executed from top to bottom. So currently I have a rule to set the declared value of 100 Rand when certain conditions are met. But now I add another rule for when an order is created with the same conditions. Order total value is greater than or equal to 1000 Rand and must be a manual order but I set the declared value to 50 Rand. If I create this rule, you will see its priority is lower than the one above. That means when the rules get executed, this will be the last one to be executed and your declared value applied will be 50 Rand. The first rule would then have been overwritten by this priority listing. But let's disable this rule for now. Let's check my rule. If I go and create a manual order and the value of this order is a thousand rand, you will see that the declared value has already been added in the More Fulfillment Options page. With the BobGo Rule Engine, you can say goodbye to manual order processing and hello to a new era of efficiency and productivity. If you need any assistance in using the Rule Engine, please contact our support team on 012-940-1060 or send an email to support at bobgo.co.za.